This is pre-calc and we're going to do a video here for the practice assessment. This is the first problem. Write a polynomial, uh, sorry, it has these zeros. So let me think about this. If, a, if it's zero, that would have come from an x. Three would have come from an x minus three. And then if I do the other ones, Uh, this 2 two plus square root of 3, that would come from x minus that whole thing. So minus uh, 2 minus root 3, because I'm subtracting the whole thing. I'm subtracting each piece. And then x minus 2 plus square root of 3. And now what I need to do is multiply it on out. If you want to use the, um, the whole uh, sum pairwise difference product rule, Multiply these, do these three together, and then multiply the answer by an x. But I'm just going to multiply it out. I'm just going to power it out. So if I multiply these two together, that's pretty easy. x times x is x squared. x times negative 3 is negative 3x. So there's that multiplied out. So if I multiply this one out, um, there's lots of ways to do it. I'm just going to distribute everything to everything. So x times x is x squared. x times negative 2 is negative 2x x times the square root of 3 is uh, the square root of 3 times x. Let me keep going. I'm going to distribute this negative 2 to everything. Negative 2 times x is negative 2x. Negative 2 times negative 2 is positive 4. Notice I'm writing over here because I'm stacking up like terms so I can combine them later. Negative 2 times root 3 is uh, 2 root 3. I don't have a 2 root 3. It's a plus 2 root 3. And let me distribute this negative root 3 now. N negative root 3 times x, that's negative root 3x. Negative root 3 times negative 2 is negative 2 root 3. And negative root 3 times root 3, let me write that over here, negative root 3 times root 3. Well, positive times a negative is a negative. Square root of 3 times square root of 3 is 3. So that's a minus 3. So if I throw these together, notice that um, these right here make a 0. No, they don't. Sorry. Uh, these right here make a zero, and these right here make a zero. So I combine up all those other uh, like terms. I have an x squared, a negative 4x, and I have a plus 1. So now I'll multiply that out. x squared times x squared is x to the fourth. Um, x squared times negative 4x is negative 4x cubed. x squared times 1 is x squared. Distribute this negative 3 on in. Negative 3 x cubed, positive 12x squared, negative 3x. And as I go to add all those pieces together, again, I like to stack up like, like terms so I don't have to think about it later. It'll be a negative 7x cubed uh, plus 13x squared minus 3x. That ought to be it.